guys, what's up? It's Danny, and today I'm here with the one and only McKinley Brown. He's what's a up? D1 sprinter here at the University of Miami. So I'm here with McKinley because I decided to challenge him to a 400 meter dash. What do you think? What do you think? This guy's crazy, man. I'm crazy? Yeah. Bro, at least I came out here, you know, on this top Miami day. I'm yeah. coming here, you know. What if I beat you? What are you gonna do if I beat you? Uh, I might do I might do some push ups. What if your what if your coach watches this and I beat you? Do you think he's gonna like recruit me, you know, take out your spot? Shit, he might. He might, he <laughs> might. <laughs> we never know. Alright, so bro, tell me, how did you get into like running? You know, you're like a D1 athlete. How did you how did this running, you know, sprinting background like what All is right, it from? So I started running track when I was about three years old. Right. Uh, my older brother ran track. Both of my parents ran track, so nice. it was kind of just in the family, in the blood, you know. Well, that's pretty cool. Like, I'm gonna be honest, you know, I'm not like a D1 athlete, yeah. obviously, you know, but uh, I did uh, cross country in high school. I also did like some track my senior year, yeah. and now I'm doing like triathlons just for fun. So, you know, maybe somehow, you know, we're on the same like playing field, yeah. you know, we could be. You're a D1 athlete, which is, he's D1, bro. D1, not D2, not D3, none of that, NAIA, D1. Bro, like, tell me, how does it feel to be a D1 athlete? Uh, it feels great, you know, I go to school for free, everything's paid nice, for. Nice, nice. Um, That's a lot of hard work though, you know, yeah, you, hard and all, work, yeah. Free education, so it's probably the, one of the best things in the world. Yeah, of course, you know, you're, you're running hard and, it, you know, just, you know, shows up with the scholarships yeah. and all, so dude, that's amazing. Yeah. But now, I'm gonna challenge him to a 400 meter dash. Which is basically, if you guys don't know what a 400 is, it's just like one, one lap. lap, yeah. One lap around the whole entire, like, you know, track. But uh, what's your main distance? Uh, 400. He's a 400 specialist, okay? I do 400s, like, to practice, and I hate doing them. I am very, very slow. My main focus is, like, really long distance, so, yeah, this should be... Interesting. This should be interesting. Yeah. much all right we would have done like an extra two laps I would have gotten you on the second lap no 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 we started off pretty even and then you know at one point I was here you were here and then you just went you know a little bit faster no it's here nah, 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 nah. <laughs> <laughs> I told you man you're crazy it's hot as hell out here it's like 90 degrees you should get in the house you know making more videos dude like it wasn't that bad, like I said, bro. You know, we were pretty, bro. You're lucky your coach wasn't here. If your coach saw that form, you've been so screwed. How about you come out and try it? Oh, all right, all right. Maybe one day do a 400 meter, uh, you know, tryout. Yeah. Maybe I could be the next, like, you know, McKinley Brown for the U. <laughs> you never know. What did you think of that race? Uh, it was kind of like a temple day for me, a normal temple day. Normal for him, it was like a little, you know, like mom, I'm going to the grocery store type thing. And for me, it was, it was a battle. 
practice. It was, it was very normal, regular practice day for me. That's probably just one of my sets in practice, so easy. It's a normal, how many sets are you in practice usually? Uh, my hardest workout was a 500, 400, 300, 300, 200. Oh, no. Nah. Yeah, I don't do that type of stuff, but uh, bro, anyways, dude, it's it was nice. nice. It was nice being able to like, you know, do this little video, you know, get in a little race, you know, have some you family around because, you know, it's all about the you really like the yeah. Buda. And hopefully, you know, with a little bit of practice in a couple of maybe months. You can be there too. I could be there too. Yeah. I could I could be a D1 track athlete. Uh -huh. Bro, you, you guys never know what could happen in life. You can do anything you put your mind to. So there we go. There we go. I like just that. Just believe it and then you can achieve it. But yeah, if you guys, uh, if you guys like this video, just remember to hit the like button. Uh, just subscribe. Yeah, subscribe. Subscribe, hit the bell. Remember, I do post weekly, so subscribe, watch all my videos. Subscribe to my channel. Oh, yeah, uh, subscribe to McKinley. He's also a YouTuber. I'm going to put it down in the description below. So, yeah, subscribe to him, subscribe uh, to me, and we're good to go. Yeah. But uh, just always remember stay hydrated. Stay hydrated.